It's the highest rated show in all of cable television. This is Monday Night Raw. This arena is so loud I can barely...
Introducing the challenger. At a total combined weight of 435 pounds, the game, Ripple Eight. And introducing the champions, at a total combined weight of 538 pounds, they are the World Tag Team Champions, Kane Put down that remote, stay a while. The King of Kings is poised and ready to begin this match for his team. It's time to play the game. All the budding tag teams out there hoping to one day make it to the big stage better be watching this match with a notepad in hand because you can bet this is going to be a lesson in how it's done. The King of Kings, Triple H, is looking as imposing tonight than at any point during his dominant 20-year reign. You know, normally I'd accuse you of kissing up to the boss, Byron, but that assessment's actually pretty spot on. Well, thanks. But guys, given the animosity here, I wouldn't at all be surprised if this match spilled out into Mannheim Road at some point here tonight. There's nothing more intimidating than when the Big Red Machine stalks his opponent. Everyone knows it's just a matter of time before they suffer total annihilation at the hands of Kane. Oh, tag made. Oh, right to the gut. Man, oh man. Kane will methodically stalk his prey. The Big Red Machine looks to destroy his adversaries and beat them into submission before he drags their carcass back to hell. I don't think anyone, with the exception of Paul Bearer, ever imagined that The Undertaker had a younger brother who was almost identical in size and strength. Kane is unstoppable. What a stomp! Good grief! Impact. This might be it. Oh, my. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity. Where the there it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Triple H with some reason for concern. You can bet he's not going to let this golden opportunity slip so easily. It might be time for him to recharge that battery. All he has to do is get to his corner and make the tag. He's certainly in a tough spot here, guys, but there's still plenty of time. Plus, it's not like his opponent is running away with this thing. Well, at least not yet, anyway. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. Ain't no stopping them now. He's fighting from underneath. Starting to struggle. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners counter here. He's a spinning ball of energy.
The game starting to stagger a bit here. Nice. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to Kane is looking at this. Can he end it here? He's fighting from underneath. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Triple H. And no luck against Kane there. Comes in off the tag. Oh, right to my gut. Big move coming. Wait for it. Is he done? Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. What a stomp! Good grief! He's fighting from underneath. He's starting to stagger a bit. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. If his opponent somehow wins this thing, you could likely go back to this moment as the turning point of the match. He isn't showing much life here, guys. Tag Team Championship up for grabs. Which team wants it more? He wants no part of the outside. Almost just a... Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. He is a one-man gang in there. He's fighting from underneath. He's fighting from underneath. Some might consider just getting a title opportunity as a success, but I assure you, this superstar will settle for nothing less than taking home the gold. Starting to struggle. Given what we've seen so far, I wouldn't at all be surprised if we see a title change here tonight. If the champ loses the title here tonight, it won't be from lack of conditioning. The damage has been done. He isn't showing much life here, guys. Wicked clothesline. The challenger not in a great place. If they want to win this match, he really needs to make a tag soon. If you told me heading into this match that he... Now that's how you make a statement. If I was Triple H, I'd tone down the showboating a little bit. What are the odds that we'll see new tag team champions come out of here? Oh, and he slips out. Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. I guess not. What are the odds we crown new tag team champions tonight? He's playing with him now. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. He's on his heels, and at this point, you have to wonder if he can recover from this. Why he's still in the match at this point is beyond me, guys. Maybe he forgot it's a tag team match. I don't know. There's got to be some explanation. He's looked great up until now, and it's imperative that he doesn't lose focus and let his opponent back into this match. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch up. Oh no! Someone call the orthodontist. He isn't showing much life here, guys. This could end it in a hurry. Can he finish him off here? One. The WWE Championship is on the line. He knows he's in trouble.
Damage is game, set, match. This one is over. I don't think he can take any more. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. You can see the wear and tear that this fight has taken out of these men. Holy cow! Double back body drop. Wow! Starting to struggle. Triple H can't be feeling good right now. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this tag team match. Unless he has no interest in walking away with the winner's end of the purse, he needs to make a tag immediately. This has been one of the most intense back and forth battles I've seen in a long time. And unfortunately for him, it's not looking so great right now. Spine buster! That should do it. You're gonna want to see your internist after a slam like that. There's got to be some... Got to shake the cobwebs. And an ear fall. I can't believe what we're seeing here. The WWE Championship is on the line. Tag Team Championship at stake. Which team wants it more? Oh, and it's a reversal. We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. He's fighting from underneath. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. One, two, dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. Yeah, even now. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. These superstars wearing the wounds right now of what has been an absolutely thrilling matchup. How these superstars are even still in it. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? That one was even more impressive than the first time we saw it. If I was Triple H, I'd tone down the show running a little bit. He's calling for it. Tag Team Championship up for grabs. Vintage pedigree! This is his opportunity to win this thing. One, two! How does he keep doing this? Can you believe what he's withstood here tonight? Starting to struggle. This has been a battle. He's fighting from underneath. And there's his speed paying off. I don't know how much more these superstars can take, guys. You'd have to think something's got to give here soon. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. Elbow drop. Piercing. He isn't showing much life here, guys. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action. That has got to be it. One, two, three. And we have our winners.
when you bring such a high level of intensity to the match, good things are bound to happen to you. And I can imagine there aren't too many people at home regretting tuning in for that amazing match. Wow.